What's going on everybody? This is Jay from Maji and Jay. Today what we got here is the Antutu test benchmark of several new MTK devices that I have received lately. The first one we got here is the THL 4000. This device carries the older MTK which is the MTK 6582. Second we got here the Elphone P5000 with the amazing battery and this one carries the MTK 6592. Third we got here the Elphone P6000 and this model carries the MTK 6732. Fourth here we got the Ufone B Pro and this baby right here carries the MTK6732 as well. Fifth we got here the Zizbo Cooper i7 and it is carrying the MTK6752 octa core. And then lastly we got here the Zizbo Cooper R8 and this model carries the MTK6595 octa core as well. So let's go ahead and get started and make sure you guys enjoy it. guys and here we have the score of each and one of them and as we can see here the THL 4000 scored 19,849 which is not bad for an MTK 6582. Second we got here the P5000 this one scored 29,628 which is not bad for the MTK 6592. Now this one right here appeared to be having some sort of error when I did the test because it only scored about 23,000 and it did give me an error. Then here we got uh, the B Pro, this one scored 31,053. Amazingly here, the one with the MTK6752, which is the Cisco Cooper i7, scored 44,944, which I think is amazing. Finally, we got here the Cisco Cooper R8, in which I thought it was going to be the winner with the MTK6595, but unfortunately it wasn't. As we can see, the score on this one was 43,813. Now let's go ahead and check here the details of this baby. Again guys, this was the winner and this is the i7. The review of this baby is coming very soon. This phone is actually quite impressive because it only goes for about $165 or $170. And as we can see guys, the score on this is absolutely amazing. Now if you check here on info, we're going to see all the information so that you guys can see that this is the i7. Here we have all the information. We got a camera of 8 megapixels on the back, but the sensor is actually very nice. You have a 5 megapixel front facing camera here. Let's go ahead and continue to scroll down so that we can see the sensor supported on here. And these are the ranking. This phone is just below the Samsung Galaxy Note 4. As we can see right here with a score of again 44,942. So this is a very impressive device and all the links of each and one of these devices will be provided down below for those who want to check it out. And that's going to conclude this video guys. Like always if you have any questions please don't forget to comment down below. Like the video, subscribe for more, thanks for watching and have a good one.